protesters all over the city tonight in actions that will prove that an armed resistance to the state exists. Some of them may be killed and some will kill. Because if we don't kill, the state will just keep on killing and they've gotten too good at it. We've got a lot of people. We have people moving through every building in this residential zone, having meetings like this. And we're going to get away with it because the security police is not nearly as strong as they would like you to fear. We didn't bring these guns here to scare you. This isn't a game. I wonder if you know what happens if they catch us. What happens when they catch people who try to talk to you honestly about what's happening in the society? I think uh, the direction that the state's moving is pretty clear. And people are going to have to make up their minds which side they're on. People are being forced to choose their sides, uh, not only in this country, but also abroad or in Mexico. Uh, I think some of you may feel the pressure when the police come by tomorrow to find out why you were here, why you didn't phone in, why you, uh, why you didn't try to stop us. Which side you're on. And you know, for example, like the media, you're not going to be able to read about what's happening tonight or see it on the TV tomorrow. You may see some junk about uh, delinquent gangs, technical malfunctions. But the government controls the media, and the government doesn't want you to know too much. The funny part is that you find out anyway. You all have ideas about what's going on in Mexico. I think some of you may understand quite well that you're closer to the Mexican students than you are to the leaders of this country, which is supposedly your country. And you hear things about uh, our black brothers' fight for survival in the ghettos, and you, you may wonder whether the newspapers tell you the real casualties in those fights. And you also know that some of you, friends or yourself here, are going a little bit crazy trying to convince yourself that you're really still free in this country. But, uh, The fact is, I don't know what you're going to do. I don't trust you too much. Some of you people may think I'm so crazy you would like to kill me. You may be trying to summon up your nerve right now to kill me. Already killed someone. But we, we know one thing about you. We know that you have people here which you do trust. And we know that the pressure's getting on so that you're going to have to get together with the people you trust and think about what you really love and how much that's worth you. And try to figure out who the real killers and the real thieves are in this country. And when you start thinking about that, you may decide you want to get in touch with us. You may want to join us.
revolutionary struggle of the American people is growing. Together, we will destroy imperialism. 